Hello friends in this video we will learn how to export or convert HTML text to Microsoft Word document format by using PHP programming script. The conversion of HTML text into the Microsoft Word document by using PHP script is the most requested functionalities. I will describe this easy thing step by step so beginners programmer can learn these things. The user can enter the title of Word file and content in HTML format and click on Export to Word button, then it will export the HTML text to Word document file and you can download and save the Word file in your local drive. In this tutorial I have simply used PHP HTTP headers, in this you need to format the HTML or PHP using word-friendly CSS and add header information to your PHP script and you cannot use external style sheet in the content and you can use simple HTML with inline CSS. Now I have moved to coding part, in coding first I have make one form for user can enter title and description for export to word file. For making a HTML form, so for this I have write form tag with method is equal to post and action is equal to export.php. After this I have to make text box for enter title, so for this I have write input type is equal to text name is equal to heading. In this text box user can enter heading for word file. And then after for entering description, I have to create one textria HTML, so for this I have write textria with attribute name is equal to description and rows is equal to 10 and close textria tag. In this textria box user can enter description for word file. And lastly we have to create one button for submit form data to PHP script. So for this I have write input type is equal to submit, name is equal to create word and value is equal to export to word. When user click on this button then form data will be submitted using HTTP POST method to export.php script and this script will execute and export HTML text to word file. Now I have moved to write PHP code export HTML to Word file format in export.php page. On this page first I want to check if there is any action received from index.php form, so for this I have write of statement with condition like set function with parameter like dollar $post create word which is name of button for submit form data of index.php. This code will check if there is any action is received from index.php if yes then it will execute if block of code for export HTML to Word file otherwise it will not execute any code. This is for reducing PHP error. In if block of I want to check both form field like heading and description has some value or not for export. So for this I have write of statement with condition like empty function with parameter like dollar post heading variable which is name of text box for enter heading text. After this I have writer operator with empty function with parameter like dollar post description variable which is name of text area for entering description in form. This condition will check both field has some value or not. If anyone will blank if will execute if block of code, so for writing this code it will check both field has value. This way we can reduce the submit blank form item. If both field or anyone field is blank then it will execute if block of code. 
In this block of code I have write echo statement with text and in text I have write open and close script tag and between this tag I have write alert with message like both fields are required. So this message will appear if blank form submitted. If user submit blank form and message will appear and then after user click on OK button then page must to be redirect to index.php page. So for this I have write echo statement with text and in text I have write javascript open and close tag and between tag I have write window.location is equal to index.php. This code will redirect page to index.php page. But suppose both fields has some value then it will execute else block of code. So in else block first I have write HTTP PHP header with open and close bracket and between bracket I have write content type with application slash VND dot Microsoft Word. By writing this code HTTP header send row HTML data from server to the user and user can save the data in the format which we have defined in content type. Here we want to get data in word format. So in content type we have defined application which is Microsoft Word. So by this code row HTML data will be converted into Microsoft Word format. After this I have again write header function with content this position attachment and file name is equal to rand php function dot file extension of Microsoft Word file which is doc. In this code content disposition header to supply a recommended file name and force the browser to display the save dialog box and Word file will be download the local drive. Then after I have write header function with Pragma with no cache, this will prevent the client from caching the response. After this I have write header function with expires to zero, generally it is also used to prevent caching in browser. After this I want to print the title in word file so for this I have write echo statement with text like this open and close html tag and between this tag I have write dollar post heading variable in which I get from form data using post method. This code will print heading on word document. And lastly I want to print description on word file. So for this I have write echo statement with dollar post description variable in which we have get the description from form in post method and it will print on Microsoft Word file. So our coding part is complete for generate Word file from HTML by using PHP script. So I have saved this code on check output in browser. Suppose friends you want to bold the first paragraph, so for this in description I have add bold tag in first paragraph and click on export button. Here you can see that HTML text exported to Word file and first paragraph has bold font. Now suppose you want to change the color of first paragraph. So for I have go to first paragraph and add inline style and in style I have write style is equal to color set to red color and click on export to word file.
Here you can see that first paragraph font color is changed to red color. So this way we can also add the style into Word file by adding HTML tag with inline style sheet. So this is my video tutorial on how to export the HTML text to Word file by using PHP programming code. If you like this video please share this video with your friends and you can also share on social media also. Friends you want to get more update of my video, so, friends you can subscribe my YouTube channel. Friends you can also like my Facebook page also or you can also follow Webs Listen on Twitter.